Hello you guys, Jaquan here, otherwise known as the Rambler Quan. <laughs> anyway, um, this is actually my first official video, besides the intro. Um, as we all know that as of recently this ex so this, this the biggest kind of controversial thing that's being talked about is ex's death. Um, and I'm here to talk about that. I have about two to three theories as what it is I'm gonna branch them all off in sections. My first one is he is dead. Here's how it goes. This this is probably where everyone else is thinking, but I probably added a little more speak to it. Um, basically, he is what everyone's saying. The people that really think he is dead is basically he's dead because he knows all the and all that blah blah. He really is dead. Um, and stuff. And that's why. That's why the TV show. You know, people making the rest and such. However, there's one little thing that I added to it. Now, I don't think he's dead just because of the shooting. As you guys know, the infamous group, the Illuminati, they, uh, whew, right um, they basically, like, you know, I mean, you know, but if you don't know who they are, they're basically the, the New World Order or whatever and such, and they basically work, they basically, like, um, they serve the devil and such. There's also things that they don't, but either way, they're, they're not that much of a group. They actually just, yeah, they, they do a lot of bad stuff. And if you, they will give you a lot of good stuff. They're doing them. I don't know how many times they DM me or something like that trying to get me to do something. Because you know I make music as well. If you don't follow me on the same thing, I might put the video. I don't know if I feel like it. But if you follow me on Instagram, if whoever follow me on Instagram, they know. Um, but yeah, they, they, they're trying to do that with me. They threaten me and stuff. Whatever. But anyway, because I didn't want to join. But anyway, if this is known, a lot of people now know that. And if you don't do what Illuminati says, they'll kill you. And if not kill you, they'll sacrifice something very impressions of yours. Apparently in this case Illuminati it took uh X away. And the reason that is because if you guys realize the change in X. To be honest, I wasn't always an X fan. I never really much was an X fan when the question mark album came out. The new one that came out a couple months ago. That's when I started getting into it. Sorry. The uh that's why I started getting into them and such. And, and then I also like 17 too. 17's really good, but I didn't hear about it. Cause like I said, I wasn't trying to listen to it. I mean, not listen to it. X, 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 Tentacion. But, um, yeah, but realized that he went from, when his first two albums or whatever, where he went from, <laughs> and all that stuff, and de death, and killing, the, killing people and stuff, and all this good stuff, to like, peaceful, changing, like, after he got out of jail, he's like, very peaceful, his beats changed, everything changed, like, his personality, everything changed, he's like an old new dude, I respect that him, I respect that ex, I like that ex, and that's what inspires me to write music, write music now, I used to freestyle, and I still do, I still do, but now I write and stuff, but, um, the Illuminati most likely didn't want that change, they most definitely want him to stay into his death, definitely, like, rock, like, rap, Side of thing for him, he was going through. Then when his depression hit, or whatever like that, he started like, recovering, and the Illuminati didn't want that. So obviously, and he knew about it, which is why he made that live video saying that if he was ever used as a sacrifice, which I didn't edit it, but I put it in the video. Uh, if he ever um, was used as a sacrifice, he wanted everybody to know that he, he hoped that his words got to people fighting their kids and all that, blah blah. That's what he meant. He knew he was he was Illuminati. He knew he was. He definitely was outraged. Um, and knew he was going to use as a sacrifice. Which possibly is what happened. However, there is also my second, my second theory, which is still developing as days go on. He is not dead. The reason why I say this is because a lot of, which is also another reason why a lot of people say these things, is because he, because so I'm not saying shit. This happens to me like playing sometimes. Um. There's proof at one point in time. Okay, here's, here's all the proof why. First thing, the video showing him dead. As we all know, a lot of people know by now that that video is kind of old. That video was made four months ago. That video was made four months ago, and I believe that was prior to him getting those tattoos. Prior to him getting tattoos on his face. On his face. I don't know X about X like that. So if he, but if he did have tattoos around the time, that was obviously not him. Also, his eye was blinking. You know, that kind of don't mean nothing because he could have been dying in the process, but he also wasn't bleeding. So. 
That video was made four months ago. It's on YouTube. You look at that same video. It's on YouTube. It's been on YouTube for the past four months. That's one, one thing. The second thing is the witnesses. There is none. Because when he's, the hospital he supposedly went to, the hospital didn't check him in ever by his whole name. Just, just, uh, just uh, whatever, how you say his name. Never got checked in for any injury. Police never got called or, went, or never got witnesses from about his death. Or sh shooting or whatever. Um, that's two. Three. It, it is possible, being that him being very rich, he wanted to stay, he wanted to be hidden. And for people to believe that he died, he paid Wikipedia. Being that Wikipedia is actually a fan, I mean, a, a, a citizen made page, they got them to say that he died. A lot of websites saying he died because, well, he probably paid for him, paid, paid him. Or the Illuminati. The Illuminati could also have something to do with that as well. Um, what's next? Also, they try to cover it up. I believe the Illuminati or X try to cover it up by posting that video he made a while back saying that he's not dead. He didn't want people to kill themselves. My, that was the old X before 17 came out. That was him like a while back, I believe. That was him when he still was doing reckless shit or whatever. That, they tried to post that trying to think that a lot of people saw through that and said, no, that's an old video. That's another thing. Also, his bio changed. In his, on his Instagram, I was paying a lot of attention to his bio because, like, a lot of this stuff, I, I deal with a lot of stuff like this. Like, I'm a big fan of Finance Freddy's, and yeah, I watch small changes, and like, that's obvious in your face. It went from saying, like, a couple of songs or whatever it was on the bio to saying, Do not disturb, which I posted on my story on my Instagram. And now, he also had, he was also following one person, but it never showed us what person that was. Now it went to zero people last night, which was pretty, pretty. Yeah, I mean, I'm pretty sure X has his own password. What you think? Pretty, he's still alive, but he's he's doing things that he's not supposed to be doing. Or he's not thinking about, which is why we're seeing these minor changes. Now, the whole thing is of this theory is that he wants to stay hidden because he's making a new album or single called No Pulse. Think about it. When they first said he was dying, it said No Pulse. I mean. You know, you use quotations when you talk about witnesses, uh, things, but there was no witnesses. So, where you get no post from? No post is probably most definitely talking about, it's probably going to be related to, relatable to the sad album. Like, well, not sad album, the question mark album, where it's talking about how he has no post or whatever, like they probably still going to do depression or whatever. Same thing as 17 is the question mark or some, or some shit. He's probably secretly, all the people that does the reacts to his death knows that he's not dead. And they're probably collaborating or just getting paid by X to say these things or getting the Illuminati to tell them to say these things which can also go with my first theory that Illuminati wants them to say these things so people can think he's dead um these people that's getting arrested they're probably getting paid to get arrested and there's a lot of this working within the deep underground with pain with money mostly. and I think that's the main thing that's going on here I think cause the album I don't know how long that takes to make an album but this is the album that he's making called No Pulse He's gonna come back, surprise us, in like a month, maybe. Or a few months, I don't know. We'll see. But the single will see him within a month. Uh, one more thing. There was one more thing. Uh, damn, fuck, I forgot what I was gonna say. Uh, shit. God damn, it was in my head, it was right there. I really forgot what I'm going to say. Hopefully, come back to you. But they are basically my theories as to why I think X is not dead. The first one, I, X, this could be X, it could be dead. I'm not going to just leave it at a standpoint that he's not dead because it could be. Yeah, I don't know. He, 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 he is hitting somewhere. He's doing some shit. He's doing some shit behind my back. So I, don't, I don't know what it is. And this is very intriguing because I like doing shit like this. I'm very glad I'm actually putting this shit on YouTube. I always want to do shit like this with like past stories and stuff. And that's my first one I actually get to talk about. There's something I was going to say though. I can't remember what it was.
fuck, I forgot what I was about to say. It was something that was hit my head. I don't even remember what it was, bro. That, that shit was right there. It was a good, it was a valid point, too. My last valid point. Oh, that, I remember now. Um, as you guys know, in 17, I think it's 17 or a Ghetto Christmas Story, one of them, he has a song called I Talked to the Devil in Miami. Now, we all know he was born in Miami. He also has a mansion in Miami. He was supposedly shot in Miami. All leading up to this. Him being shot in Miami, which is also a quotation, such as no post, which would also be naming quotations if it was an album name. I Got Shot in Miami is most definitely probably a song. It's probably his intro to his no post. I think that's what's going to happen right now. We're going to see. We're going to see. Because I, I bet you, I bet you that before the summer ends, actually, he's, he's not dead, y'all. And if he is, then leave it out of y'all. Once again, I thank y'all for watching my video. Uh, subscribe if you like this video. If this is your first time, like the video, blah, blah, blah. Don't just like it. That shit's a target. This like button right there. If you don't like it, just don't press the like button. Comment what you think about the video. If you want to put something in there, I might bring you up or whatever in my next video. Blah, blah. I hope they get better with editing and go a long time. But a lot of YouTubers, like, big YouTubers make it because they make mistakes and learn new things. So, um, yeah. You know, just spread the coin. Tell me what y'all think in the comments below. Do y'all think my theories are right or close? Or not? What's your theories about it? What's going on? Um, if there's anything you think I missed, I'll make another video. Gotcha. Part 2. Next video, I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. I think the next video I'm going to probably go, um, talk about me. See how I can be me as a person. Uh, spread the coin. Hey, I'll see y'all next. See ya.